Hi, I'm Amy Kelly, and tonight we're broadcasting at Costa Vida. Yes, it's Tooele, and you know we have a lot to choose from out here when it comes to Mexican food. But let me tell you what, tonight you're going to learn why this is one of your best options for Mexican. With me is Kelly, and she is the manager here at Costa Vida. What's fun is that you've recently been put into this position, correct? Yes, that's correct. Oh my gosh, and so how long have you been with the company? Um, since we opened, since about May of uh, 2010, 2009-ish. That's great. And, and how have you liked it so far? Oh, I've loved every bit of it. It's a really fun, exciting environment, a place to get comfortable with your customers and show them their options of food and kind of direct them through the line. Well, Kelly, tell me, what makes you guys so special as far as Mexican? What is the thing that sets you above and beyond the rest? Tell me. Um, well, one thing that sets us pretty different than anybody else is we're outstanding with our customer service skills. My employees are very great at getting their customers through the line quick and showing them exactly what their meal's about and having them with a fun, enjoyable experience. So very loyal customers, I'm sure. Very, very loyal, yes. Tell me, when it comes to food, that's right, we're coming here for our bellies, folks. <laughs> and I like to come here because I know I'm going to get full. Yes. I love, <laughs> I like to eat, too. But I know I'm going to get full and I know it's fresh. What types of things do you guys make from scratch on site? Um, we make everything from scratch. Starting from pico to the hot prep, pork, beans, everything. Everything is freshly made. Oh my gosh, so we're not talking anything from a can? No, nothing from a can. That's my kind of place. I love the homemade from scratch because I'm a food snob, I admit it. <laughs> but I like to know it's from scratch, so that's wonderful. Um, and another thing we do with our cold prep is we make it two times a day. We make it in the morning and in the afternoon. So that way it's fresh at all times for our customer to enjoy it. Oh, I love it. Tell me, how many pounds of tomatoes do you guys go through for your salsa? Oh, we make about a three by of pico, which usually consists of about 12 to 18 containers wow. a day. So about pounds of tomatoes, we would, I would say, go through about... 55 pounds a day? Wow. Just of our tomatoes. Just of tomatoes alone. You know, that's amazing. And my gosh, people must be mowing through this stuff because that says it's good. It 55 is. pounds. Definitely good. <laughs> oh, and not to mention, I love the tortillas from scratch as well. Yes, from scratch. They make it, they'll start it in the dough mixer, then they let it rise. After it's risen, they start rolling them out, cook them on the tortilla uh, grill, and then they're fresh to serve. Oh my gosh, now how fresh are they as far as have they been made that day or are they made just before usually? They're made throughout the day as we need the tortillas. And then that way it's fresh at all times, it gets risen at appropriate times, and then that way we also have three different choices from it as well. So tell me, what are the different options tortilla-wise? Um, we have our corn, which is a six inch, and then we have our flour, which is six inch and 12 inch, and then we also have our wheat which is 6 inch and 12 inch. I have to admit, I'm a food snob like I said, but I'm a health nut too, and I like that you have whole wheat. Whole wheat's I mean, best. Yeah. Whole wheat's definitely the best. That's a great option. I, I can't find that anywhere else here in Tooele, folks. So, <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, if you're a health nut like me, you know where to come. Fantastic. Well, show me how you start doing your, your Pico, right? Okay. Pico? Yes, definitely. Here, let me uh, get these gloves on. Very sanitary, right? Very, very sanitary. <laughs> All right. So I'm just going to kind of bring this right over to, to where the you guys can see it a little bit better. Um, so we have this scale right here, which is what we use to weigh everything out. Um, and then we have the cilantro and everything in here that we use. We just pretty much throw it right on in here. We add a little bit of this uh, garlic. We add a little bit of this salt right here as well. And then we just chop these tomatoes up and we throw them right in this dicer to where it just dices them up to where they're in this nice cube type texture. That is slick. Yes. That is slick. I want one of these. It's on my Christmas wish <laughs> list. Did you see that? <laughs> Look at that. That's amazing. Perfect. You wondered how they did it. I know you did. Now you know. Okay. Awesome. And then after you're done doing that whole product right there, you just kind of mix it up with your hands or even a spoon, get it all going, and then you just throw it right into one of these containers with a date dot showing your time, the initials, and the date. So you know who made the batch. <laughs> exactly. So that way we know who's making it. We make sure they're doing it correctly at all times and 
That way our customers are very pleased. And you no wonder because you guys pay attention to detail and I like that. All right. Well, fun. I think we want to take a look up front here in just a minute and see how you guys actually assemble some of this stuff. Joining me now is Kenna, one of the employees here at Costa Vida. And I understand, turn around, we've got a cool shirt here. It says Killer Shrimp Crazy Good. And I understand it is crazy good. It's the latest thing you've got here now? Yes, it is. Big popular seller for you? It really is. A lot more than our own shrimp. So uh, <laughs> it's really Shrimp good. is delicious. So walk me through the process. How does it work? All right. So for, it depends on the um, size. If we do two tacos, we'll do 16 pieces of shrimp if it's for one um, just eight pieces and same with our regular and small salads so we'll do uh, so you're actually getting quite a bit of shrimp yeah quite a bit it's really a good deal so you get the shrimp here and then we'll do our honey butter um, and it's just a mixture of like onions and peppers and butter it's really good it's kind of a sweet and spicy um, we'll get that in there We'll put it in here and just kind of let it melt for a little while. And once that's all good and melted, we put it through our impinging oven and that's how it cooks. And we usually send it through three or four times until um, it's at 145 to make sure it's healthy for our customers. Well, I tell you what, I notice you guys get a lot of business and especially on a weekend night. Have you said this is one of your top selling items. What else is a big seller for you guys here? Um, well, especially on Friday nights, we do a lot of chicken nachos because that's our special for today. Um, but we do a lot of pork as well. That's a big seller for us. So. Wonderful. Well, I'm excited. I understand you do catering too, right? We do, yep. Uh, corporate parties. It's coming up that time of year, I guess. Yeah, for sure. We do a lot of catering and we do deliveries too if it's over $36. So I didn't know that. So nice and convenient. Again, no wonder you guys get customer service. That's fantastic. Well, you're going to find so many delicious things to eat here at Costa Vida. Really, folks, good stuff here. And you're going to find it with Kelly especially as she manages a fantastic team who is noted for their customer service at Costa Vida right over here next to the shopping center at Walmart. Come check them out.